today I have my perfume collection video for you and this is a video which I was umming and eyeing about doing but truth be told I haven't got a clue what type of videos you guys want to see so if you have any suggestions then leave them down below because right now I'm stumped so I thought I'd do a I thought I'd drag my hair across my face apparently so yeah, I thought I'd do a perfume collection for you guys, just so you guys can see what my perfumes are and also what ones are my favourite. And that I haven't got that big a range, so yeah. But yeah, that's it. Um, I hope you enjoy. All of my links are right here, so go check all of those out. Make sure to give this video a big thumbs up, drop me a comment down below telling me what videos you guys want to see. And also make sure to subscribe if you haven't already and we best get into this video. Okay, so all of my perfumes are pretty much the same. I like sweet scents pretty much. Um, I have a few different little perfume things. But yeah, mostly sweet is my main smell threshold. So yes. Okay, so the first perfume that I have to show you is the Ari by Ariana Grande perfume and I love this thing it smells really nice and the bottle is just adorable this is the 50ml size and I use this for special occasions so when I go out and all that but this is a very sweet smelling perfume it's sweet with a hint of something I would say it's sweet with a hint of floral to it but it's really nice I will put the notes right here so you guys know what the notes are in this but I really do love this perfume it smells really really gorgeous and yes I love this this is literally I think um my third my third favorite perfume this one right here okay well since I'm going from third I may as well just tell you my second this is the um angel perfume by Terry Mute by Terry Mugler. I have four mini sample, not samples, I have four mini bottles of this. Um, I haven't used it yet because this is literally like the holy grail to me. Um, I love the smell of this. This isn't actually sweet. This is more of a, I want to say fresh. Yeah, this is more of a fresh smell, but it's, it's a weird fresh smell if that makes any sense. It's a really nice fresh smell. I don't know, as I said, I'll put the notes here because I'm really bad at describing scents, but I love this and I can't get the lid back on. There we go. Yeah, I love this thing and it smells gorgeous. So yes, I have four mini bottles of this. Okay, so my first favorite perfume of all time is the Nina by Nina Ricci. Um, this is the apple. This is amazing I love this the leaves have actually broke off of this but this is my favorite perfume of all time and as you can see I am halfway through it already but as I said I only wear this for special occasions as well I rarely wear this one my angel and Ari just because of the fact that they are my favorite perfumes and I will only wear them on a special occasion but I love this again this is really sweet and fruity I love it it's amazing Go get, your, go get yourself some. Okay, so going on next, this is the uh, Giorgio Armani Diamonds Perfume. Again, I really like this. This is a... This, again, is more of a fresh smell, but I'd probably say that this has some fruit in it. It smells a little bit fruity, um, and again, more fresh. I find that more expensive perfumes are usually more fresh. But I really like this one. Again, this one has to be below, just below those guys. So probably say fourth favourite right here. I love this. Again, I'll put the notes so you guys know what I'm talking about. But yeah, I love this as well. And then we have the Enchanted Wonderstruck by Taylor Swift. This would be my fifth favourite if I had a fifth favourite. This is just pure sweetness. This thing is gorgeous. I am literally almost out of this. So I'm going to be sad when it all goes. This just reminds me of sweets for some reason, but I love it. Um, the bottle is gorgeous. It's got this um, rosy monochrome thing going on. I love it. And it's got like, little charms. But yeah, I love this thing. The only thing is the lid broke with me when I took the lid off. So I've got like the whole lid here and then just that. <laughs> but yeah, um, I love this again. Number fifth favorite perfume. Okay, and then I've got the Vera Wang Princess Perfume. Again, this would be my sixth favourite perfume. Um, this is the... I'm not too sure. This is a 30ml bottle, so it's still quite big. Um, I think that this one is a sweet one as well. I can't smell anything. Oh, Jesus, I sprayed it too much there. 
Yeah, this is again a sweet one. This smells like alcohol. But that, that whole whiff right there that I got was alcohol. It doesn't smell like alcohol, but it, this again is a sweet one. Um, I think that this is just pure sweet. I don't think that there's anything else in this. Um, but yeah, again, I really like this. It's a nice perfume and yes. Okay, so my next favourite, I can't remember what number I'm on, but is the Lady Gaga perfume. This stuff is smells really, really good. But the only thing is that it is black and it turns your clothes black. So, and it also turns your skin, like where you spray it, like you have, you have like black drips running down. But if you don't spray it that far, like that close, then it shouldn't be a problem. But again, it doesn't stain your clothes either. But this thing smells really nice as well. Okay, all I can smell is Angel right now. But... Yes, I love this thing as well. As I said, the only thing I would change is the colour of the liquid. And then we have the Katy Perry Killer Queen perfume. Again, this is just pure sweet. I have this on today. This is usually my everyday perfume. Same as the Vera Wang Princess. This and um, Vera Wang is basically my everyday perfume. So if you ever want to know what I'm wearing, I'm probably wearing this. Not going to lie. Um, but yeah, again, this is just a sweet smelling. I love it. It's gorgeous. And yeah, everyday perfume right there. And then the last one is the Nicki Minaj perfume. I think that this is Pink Friday. Um, I bought this ages ago. I think I bought this last Christmas. This is a 30ml bottle, so it's quite small. Um, but yeah, I used to love it, and now, now this is more of a throw in my bag for whenever I need a quick touch up during the day. I don't really wear this one that often anymore, but yes. I have it anyway. Again, it's still quite a nice smelling. It's quite sweet. So yes. Okay, so that is all of my perfumes for you guys. I'm sorry that this video wasn't that informative, but I'll leave the notes and the price and everything like that and the size bottle, which I have, just so you guys can go check them out if you want. Also, all of the links, like so all of the perfumes will be down below if you want to go check them out. And yes, um, I hope you enjoyed. Make sure to give this video a big thumbs up, drop me a comment down below, and make sure to subscribe if you haven't already. And I will see you very soon in my next video. Bye, guys.